award the gold winning trophy. It's my pleasure to invite to the stage engineer Sammy Ambofler, the CEO of the Hills Group of Company, to the stage. Please make him welcome. Take a look at our shortlist for Renaissance. a lot of competition from our shortlisted nominees tonight. Congratulations to everybody who got their name up on the main page. Our first bronze trophy winner for Renaissance goes to the one Durham coin for the one Durham cup for McDonald's. Change has a taste, Coca-Cola. And our next silver trophy for Renaissance goes to one JBR. It's not for everyone. Bye to my properties. Congratulations to our bronze and two silver trophies. But we've got a gold winner in that envelope. Whose name is in that envelope? Um, the winner is University Pride Niscafe. the official coffee for university students. Suffering from harsh price ups, the brand needed to think value first, and so it resorted to relying on its cheapest SKU, the three-in-one sachet. Three-in-one was the perfect single cup of coffee, and so it was often used to recruit coffee newbies. The problem was, we needed to find newbies in the millions. Where would we find them? Universities all around the country. So we launched a two-phased campaign, first tapping into the inter-student rivalries between the different majors, launching 50 new pack designs, each dedicated to a specific major. With the packs, we launched three loud, proud chants, each defending their turf and provoking others around them. Overnight, a challenge erupted online as students across the country got together to create their own versions of our chants. <laughs> our sales momentum started to fly off. We didn't stop there though. We wanted to ensure we covered all the stereotypes students faced. And so we launched a second wave, this time with a range of flavored coffees to prove that we understood. 